Today's class, I am going to discuss about how to write the very large HDL code for 2 bit magnitude comparator. So, using data flow model. So, previous video we discussed the truth table for the comparator and K map simplification, then find the Boolean expressions. So, these are the Boolean expressions in A less than B, A equal B, and A greater than B. So, if you need a kindly refer the video. So, before writing the program, first I recall the term comparator. So, what is comparator? So, comparator in the sense just comparing the two parameters. So, let me take here two variables A and B. So, these two input values is given to comparator. So, after comparator, comparison, it may produce three possible outputs. So, first output is A value A equal to B. So, it is the first of all possible output. Then A is less than B. It is the second possible. A is greater than B. It is the third possible output. So, after comparison, it may produce the any one of the output. A is equal to B. A less than B. A greater than B. So, now I draw the block diagram for magnitude comparator. So, it is a magnitude comparator. Input is A and B. So, A and B is the input. They produce the three possible outputs. So, A equal B, A less than B, A greater than B. So, this A and B is the input variable. So, these three are the output variables. So, this input variable is 2 bit value. So, 1 is to 0. A naught, A 1, B naught and B 1. The corresponding truth table and simplification we discussed in previous video. If you need a kindly refer it. So, Using this Boolean expression, I am going to write the very large HDL code using data flow model. So, first write module, then module name. So, module name is magnitude comparator. So, it is a module name mag hyphen comparator. So, within a bracket, mention the input variable and output variable. So, input variable is A and B. So, A comma B is the input variable and output variable. A equal to B, A less than B, A L B, greater than A greater than B. So, A equal B, A less than B, A greater than B. So, these three are the output variable. So, input 1 is to 0, A comma B. Then output A equal B, A less than B, A greater than B. So after initialize the module length, then declaration of input variable and output variable. Initial begin assign. A less than B. So, first I take the condition A less than B. So, A less than B equal to the corresponding Boolean expression is A1 bar B1 plus A0 bar B1 B0 plus A1 bar A0 bar B0. So, not of A1 and B1 or so, not A0 and D1 and B0 or not of A1 and not A not and B zero. So it's an equation for A less than B. Then come to A equal B. Assign A equal B. So here the expression is a zero uh, 
x naught. So naught cap. So it's a symbol for x naught. Mm, b zero. So a zero b zero then and here a one. So a one not cap b one. So it's an equation for x naught operation. So e equal b. Then come to a greater than b. So here first you take this product mm, a zero and not of b one and not b zero. Then or operation. So a one and not b one. Then or so a one and a zero and not b zero. So it's a assign a greater than b expressions. Then finally, end and end module. So close the module. So it's a simple program for magnitude comparator using data flow model. So first you draw the block diagram, then assign the input variable and output variable, then finding the Boolean expression using truth table. So based on the Boolean expression, we can easily write the magnitude comparator data flow model program. So first you initialize module and module name, then input variable and output variables. Uh, then form the equation. So assign a less than b, the corresponding Boolean expression, write it here. Then a equal to b, corresponding Boolean expression, write it here like this. Then a greater than b, the corresponding expression, write it here like this. Then finally, a and end module. So I hope you understand the concept very well. If you are watching first time in my video, kindly subscribe and support us to make a lot of videos. Thank you.